morning boys and girls it is JD here and I'm so excited to see you guys today all right it's the last Sunday of the month of May and so I'm gonna ask you guys our monthly question one last time and our question is whose way is perfect and do you guys remember the answer to that question whose way is perfect yes God's way is perfect awesome job everybody all right and so Later on, we're gonna hear a story about Gideon. And Gideon was told to do something by God. And um, I think uh, you'll learn more about that later, whether he actually listened to what God said or, or not. But I can't wait for you guys to hear that Bible story. But for right now, we are going to do some fun activities. Uh, I want you guys to stand up. All right, so you are going to listen and watch for what I am going to do, and then you are going to do them with me, okay? So the first thing we're going to do is we are going to do 10 toe touches. So what they're going to look like, you're going to lift up your leg, you're going to touch your toes, and you're going to do 10 of them. Okay, are you ready? You got to count the 10 with me. Here we go. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten! Good job, everybody! Did you get to do all ten of your toe touches? Awesome job. Okay, so the next thing we are gonna do is we are going to do five twists. So all you're gonna do is take your body and you're gonna twist just like this, back and forth, okay? All right, you ready? Five twists. Here we go. One, two, three, four, and five. Awesome job, everybody. All right, let's see. What are we gonna do next? Hmm, how about we hop on one foot? All right, we're gonna do that eight times. All right, you guys ready? Lift up your leg. And you gotta hop like on one foot, okay? Here we go. One, two, three, four, four five. Gotta keep your balance. Six, seven, eight. Awesome job, everybody. That was eight hops on one foot. Did you get to do it? That was kind of hard. I kind of went back and forth. I lost my balance a little bit. All right, let's think. Let's do one more thing. Hmm. Let's see. How about we clap four times? All right, you got it? We're gonna clap four times. Are you ready? Here we go. One, two, three, four. That's it. Awesome job, everybody. Thank you so much for doing all these different things with me. Thank you for listening and doing what we what we can do together. Um, like I said like earlier, later on in the Bible story, you're going to hear about Gideon. And God tells him to do something. And let's see if he actually pays attention and actually does what God says. All right. I will see you guys next week. All right. Bye. <laughs>
Oh, hi there, friends. I'm Zoe, and I just found my old jump rope. But sadly, I can't jump in it right now because I have a cast. But I love that I get to jump in so many different ways. I could jump like a kangaroo. Or a frog. Ribbit. 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 Or a grasshopper. It's so fun jumping in so many different ways. Ho! Ho! It's Ollie! Hello, Zoe. Ho! Ho! Jumping all around, are you? Hi, Ollie. I sure am. There are so many different ways I can jump. Jumping is fun. It's true. Jump, jumping God's way is perfect for you. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Ho! Ho! Follow me through, follow me through, who? I've got a Bible story for me and you. Ah, there we go. <laughs> Hola, friends. I'm Luis, the handyman. I'm just making sure this is ready for my niece. She's getting a new frog tomorrow, and we don't want it to be able to jump away. <laughs> See? All done. <laughs> it's perfect. Perfect. That reminds me of our story today. Do you want to help me build it? Great. Let's put it on the story fence. Hammers up, little builders. Ready. Uno, dos, tres, hammer. Great job, little helpers. You can put your hammers down. Now we just need our story tools. Yep, we have everything we need. Today's true story from the Bible begins with a man named Gideon. One day God said, take an army and go defeat the big, powerful Midianites. Now Gideon knew that God's way is perfect. So Gideon jumped, jumped and went God's way. He got together the biggest army of men he could find. <laughs> Look at all of them. They were ready to go. But God said, Gideon, you have too many men. Make the army smaller. Hmm. So Gideon said to the army, if anyone's afraid, you can go back home. Wow, that's a lot of men. How will they defeat the Midianites now? But Gideon knew that God's way is perfect. So he jumped, jumped, and went God's way. The army was now ready to go again. But God said, there are still too many men. Make the army even smaller. Take them to the water and tell them to get a drink. Then God said, the men who put their faces down to the water should leave. The men who lifted the water to their mouth with their hands should stay. Now there were only a few men left in the army. But God said, go and fight, I will be with you. So once again, Gideon jumped, jumped, and went God's way. Charge! And what do you think happened? Did they win or lose? They won! Of course they did! Because God's way is what? Perfect! <laughs> it's true! You know, sometimes when God asks us to do something, it doesn't always make sense. But we can trust that God's way is perfect. So we can jump, jump, and go God's way. Hey there, Ali. Tell me, whose way is perfect? God's way is perfect. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, whose way is perfect? God's way is perfect. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. So there's your story, and it's all true. Gideon jumped God's way, and you can too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. 
Ho! Ho! What a great story! Gideon started with a big army, and then God said, make it smaller. Gideon went God's way and won the battle. God's way is perfect. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good! It's fun being able to do things like a frog or a kangaroo, but it's even better to do things God's way. God's way is perfect. I'm going to jump, jump God's way. I'll see you next time. Bye! God's way is perfect. 2 Samuel 22, 31. God's way is perfect. 2 Samuel 22, 31.